Today's episode is brought to you by Bespoke Post. New subscribers get 20% off if you head on over to bspk.me slash rogue2 and use promo code rogue20 at checkout. Nailed it. Nailed it. That was good. You're welcome, Bespoke Post, and all of our fans and friends. And my mom, your son is a success. This is it, Murphy! Calm down. Revengeance is mine! Revengeance! Okay, he gets Drones. a little... It's not like some sort of conspiracy that they have against you. You okay, need to relax. Look, look there are gun. two times I have gotten seven stitches. One was a drone's fault, the other was yours. Let's decide who our common enemy is. The drones. <laughs> Revengeance! The drones. Now keep in mind, I'm I'm on both sides of this issue because I've been physically attacked by a drone before. And you've also had someone shooting at your drone. It was a very expensive drone! Very. Corey, explain the legality of what we're doing right now. You cannot legally shoot down an aircraft. That is that that has been proven. Full stop that has been anywhere. proven time and again. I, Generally the FAA does not permit you to shoot aircraft out of the air, no matter what. But where they really get these from is prisons. So sorry. You get those from well, prisons. You, they, use them, they sell them to prisons. Very uh, easy to yeah, smuggle. Yes. Yeah, ooh. Oh. <laughs> they uh, fly the drones over, the bad guys, they drop off drugs. They don't want that to happen, or cell phones, or whatever the drones are dropping off. Oh, so, so this is contraband mitigation. Yes, 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 yes. And so they have lots of stories of guards actually using these to shoot down drones. These are just packed with nets, yeah, basically? Kind of, yes. So there are six different metal pieces, and on each one of these six pieces, there is a string tied. So it's kind of a star pattern. So as soon as this comes- Spider-Man web! Spider-Man. I've always thought he needed a shotgun. So it shoots out in kind of a, in a, in a mini web, and it's supposed to snare the drone. Now I've seen quite a few videos on this, and it's a, uh, Mixed results, because if the drone's really close, then it's basically just buckshot and it destroys the just drone. Just blasts it away. Mm -hmm. And then yeah. obviously when you're shooting six different pieces of metal with strings, lots of wind can create a difficult situation to hit a drone. We're all guessing here, but what's the optimal distance you want to be to, to ensnare a drone without destroying it? I don't know the exact range. Guess. But it seems to Guess. be somewhere around. Let's, Guess. It's exactly... 25 yards. <laughs> Knew it. Called it. That's exactly. what I thought too. That's a good answer. I guess we test it. Yeah. Yeah. So this is just a standard 12 gauge round. Just weird. Yes. Got it. All right. Didn't Ooh. do that right. Mm. <laughs> Auspicious no. start. I, I Modern Rogue. But this is designed to work in regular 12 gauges, Correct. right? Yes. yes. Okay. All right, we are loaded. Safety is off. Test firing in three. Two, one. Nice. Did it, is that, did it just disintegrate? I mean, it was festive. Did you just give him the confetti shell? Yeah. This isn't a prank show, is it? I don't understand. <laughs> I think we might need to test it on an actual drone and not just the air. My guess is that that mesh is finer than we would think. Yes. Oh, and we just didn't see it? Yeah. Do you have some magic ability to summon drones to yes, hover yes. over here? I will use my Seth AI. Your Seth AI. My Seth AI. Okay, uh, and, and we how does it go? We summon drones into the air to destroy. Like no, this. I just say, drones rise. Drones rise! Maybe we all have to say it. It's like an incantation. Uh, one, two, three. Drones rise! Drones rise! Oh, it worked. Oh. There all we right. go. All right. Drone, make this easy on me. A little to the right. All right, a little bit up. Stop. Drone. Oh! That's how powerful my skills are. <laughs> so good. Go f with the wizard drone. <laughs> that was telekinesis. <laughs> I don't even done know why I need this episode yet. Yeah. That's how good these work. <laughs> Shall we try again, gentlemen? Yes. A little, little less strong this time. I think the last one was well, a little too strong. If we whisper it, maybe a smaller drone will appear. <laughs> Great idea. Ready? One, two, three. Drone rise. Drone rise. That's that's a smaller drone. Try not to kill it with your mind bullet. Here we go. All right. Safety gun is live. Ooh. 
<laughs> Is that mocking me? I think, I think it's <laughs> mocking you. I think it was just laughing. All right. <laughs> Hold on. Drone. Gun is live. <laughs> oh, I mean, I hit it, but I also did very poor form because it definitely almost bunked me in the nose. Oh, <laughs> like I was man. practically part of a fail video. Yeah. <laughs> so here's the question. Do, do we think the spider web ensnared it? I guess. I guess we gotta find out. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Oh, it's still. It's still alive. <laughs> is it ensnared? Thank you so much, Seth. Yeah, oh man, that's that is awesome. Okay, so it's definitely ensnared. There's less fiber than I would have expected, but once it gets tangled into these propellers, that's all you need, right? Yeah. Oh, man, there's some bog muck on there but there's also these strings and I guess, oh wow, yeah, you got it pretty dead on with that. Yeah, you could see the, uh, did, did anything blast apart? I don't know if any of the shells hit. Uh, uh, got here. Yeah, it oh, looks yeah, like we've got- see something hit. Yeah, you've got a little bit of damage here too. It looks like something broke off there. So it looks like the shell is a combination of thick ropes that immediately tangle inside. It's like once the rotor gets it, then it's done, right? Yeah. It just, it does all the work for it. So now the question is- Can you hit a moving one? Yeah. Place your bets, folks. <laughs> Absolute, absolutely three, not. Three shells? Three shells. Three shells. You think, right. uh, okay, okay, okay. What okay. is it, $10 a shell? Oh. Yep, three uh, shells, I'll buy five. They are pricey. <laughs> I am a drone, I'm gonna fly, going through the sky. I hope Brian doesn't shoot me. Hey, oh, shit. that's a <laughs> much different one. Massive. Wow. That there is an eagle of a different feather. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Okay. Agile little thing. Right. Uh. <laughs> Give me three Good shells. <laughs> three <laughs> shells. Three shells. Three shells. Yeah. All right. All right. Step right up, sir. Step right up. You look like someone who has experienced great indignity at the hands of the drones. <laughs> yes, yes. Were you humiliated, uh, perhaps live on the internet before, Shut uh, up. or the internet mocked you, perhaps, for your uh, uh, for your subservience to your drone masters? Do you fear that they will one day come for your family? Because they will. They have told me, sir, that they can take your family from you oh. whenever they please. Oh. They can come and spirit your daughters off to Drone City, where they will make them their drone bride. So, best of luck, sir. Come right up and take a shot. Why can't I load these? <laughs> it doesn't matter. He can't hit it anymore. Anyway. Auspicious beginning. I'll he do can't just, hit uh, it. just one at a time. I only need the one shot. Well, take your shot then, sir. You'll never get it, but uh, best of luck to you, my friend. Weapon is live. Waiting until it's safe. Oh. <laughs> you like that sassy little flip? I didn't like the mocking yeah. gestures. Yeah, if a drone could give you the finger, I think that's what it just did. You should probably put these in. Yeah, that's a good call. <laughs> it's probably fine. Probably fine. Put that on our tombstone. Mm. All right then, uh, how about another shot, sir? Do you feel that you have the fortitude to take down this what is nothing but a children's toy? If you feel that it has bested you, then feel free to admit defeat. There is no shame. Weapon is live! Nope. No chance. <laughs> oh! Yeah! Nailed <laughs> it! Revengeance is mine! <laughs> My hand is suddenly beautiful. No, it's still horrifically scarred. It was an empty gesture after all. Do you feel better? I do. If you're going after revenge, dig two graves. I'll tell you what, man. I could totally see, like, 
elite exports uh, clay pigeons being a sport. That was a lot more interesting and fun, having knowing that there was a human mocking me on the other end of that. <laughs> that, that was, was that amazing, wasn't a human. Dude. That was an AI, remember? Uh, oh, oh yeah. that's right. Sorry, AI. Yeah, they're yeah. evil, yes. Yeah. These are, what, about uh, uh, less than $10 yeah. a shell? Yep, yeah, exactly, about $9 a shell shipped. That was fun. <laughs> <laughs> Now you're ready for the uprising. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I mean, <laughs> I found peace. <laughs> Me and drones, we're cool now. <laughs> we'll see. How was it that both of us picked bags for our bespoke post this month? Mine is the Weekender. Yes, it's rugged yet professional, much like myself. I got this sweet, <laughs> sweet bag. It's a portable cooler that you can strap onto your back and take anywhere. It's got an inflatable bag in the middle so you fill it with air so that it keeps your cold stuff cold or, I don't know, maybe you want to walk around with a rotisserie chicken. I often do carry around a bag <laughs> of rotisserie chicken. Do I have the bag for you, my friend? That's fantastic. And you're going to use this a lot during the dog days of summer. It's already happening. Do you realize it's it's two in the morning right now. Texas, the sun stays out all day long. Unforgiving. It's constantly a hundred degrees. The land of eternal sunshine. I've is what never they call been it. more thankful for Bespoke Post. Bespoke Post has themed boxes, new ones every month, and you can sign up for a subscription, but there is no commitment. I love the fact that they actually give a damn. They tell a story with every single box, and you get to choose your box, or you can have them choose for you. If you don't like what you're queued up to get, just say like, eh, skip this month, come back next month. But each box is only $45 and usually worth over $70. Yes, you can get something like the Rugged Yet Professional Weekender. Or, or the Rugged and Yet Unprofessional Boat Ender, aka the Boozer. Think shaving kits, shoe shine kits, all sorts of accoutrement that you need for your lifestyle. People go to bspk.me slash rogue2 and use rogue20 to get 20% off if you're a new subscriber. Yeah. And Brian, as the safety manager, I gotta say this for legal reasons, if you could uh, restrain your shots, shots to the uh, middle here, that'd be great and not shoot any of your crew members. Just a... Uh... Good, good tip, Corey. Yeah. Definitely been said I know, now. I know it's <laughs> I know you're excited.